Jeff Carson with Carson Woodworks again. I'm going to show you how to repair minor defects in wood with a quick and easy method using these items right here. First you need a sample of the type of wood you're going to repair, in this case figured maple. You need two grits of sandpaper, 120 grit and 220 grit, a rubber sandpaper pad, an artist knife, and uh, some cyanoacrylate glue, which is super glue, and some uh, super glue accelerator. What I'm going to repair are some small wormholes that I don't think you'll be able to see on the video uh, on this figured maple box top. Now the first thing you want to do is generate some sawdust using a scrap of the same kind of wood that you're repairing. And to do that, just put the scrap in your vise, Take your 120 grit sandpaper and your rubber sanding pad and go ahead and build up a little mound of sawdust right here in front of the sanding pad. Doesn't take much, but it's always good to have a little extra. Okay, now you can see I've got a little build up there of uh, the dust that we're going to use for the repair. do is take the glue and put a drop right over those and fill those holes up with super glue. Just one drop each in my case here. Now I'm going to take the artist knife and scoop up a little bit of the dust and just drop it right on top of there. Like I said, it's good to put too much on there because it's not like uh, that's going to be a problem. The other stuff, will come, the, the balance will come off. Now with it on there, I'm just going to take this knife, I'm just going to press it in like that. I'm going to pick up the rest of that that got pushed out of the way and I'm going to pack it in there again. Again, you can see why you want more dust than you really need because uh, a lot of it gets pushed aside. Okay. That's that. Now you just shake off the excess and take your accelerator and just squirt one sprout on there. And by the time you take all of this stuff and put it away, um, this will be cured. Okay, so after that glue is cured, which only takes a matter of seconds, just take your 220 grit paper Sand that flat. Sand that extra buildup of glue and sawdust. And there you have a quick and easy repair that will disappear when the finish is applied. And thanks again for watching this episode of Carson Woodworks Presents. that you won't even notice after you put the finish on the wood because the finish darkens the wood and because it darkens the wood you won't notice that spot right put the finish on the wood